The University of New Mexico Human Resources Department will begin interviews in the next few days into its investigation of head football coach Mike Loxley. That investigation's prime focus is his physical assault on assistant coach J.B. Gerald. But according to what UNM's vice president for HR told us today, it may go beyond that. News 13's Alex Tomlin is live in the Newsplex. Dick Loxley's contract makes it clear that if he violates the terms of his contract, he can be fired for cause. Here's the contract, all seven pages. It specifically says that moral turpitude or a major or repeated minor violation of school policy could result in termination. But what does that really mean? Determine if his behavior met that standard of moral turpitude. What is that standard? I don't have that in front of me right now. UNM's Human Resource Department started its own investigation at the request of Athletic Vice President Paul Krebs. As we continued to discuss the situation further, we determined that perhaps that there are other issues that are broader in scope that have been brought up that we should look at. Gonzalez would not say what other issues she's talking about. How does this stepped-up probe sit with the coach? Are you concerned you'll be fired, Coach? I mean, that can always be, uh, that could always happen. Um, am I concerned about it? No. The police report says Loxley punched Coach Gerald in the mouth. Loxley says it's not quite that way. So what did happen? There's so many rumors going around is what happened? You know, was it just a, a heated argument? Was there a punch? Was there a slap? Can you clarify that for us? Again, I mean, obviously with an investigation going on and uh, probably be to my advantage to not comment further than other than I take full responsibility for the altercation that did take place. This isn't the first time Gerald and Loxley have clashed. The Daily Lobo sports director reported the two got into a heated argument after a preseason practice in August. He says, quote, Loxley pestered Gerald, continually advancing towards him as the wide receivers coach attempted to distance himself from Loxley. The Daily Lobo reporter couldn't hear what they were talking about, but says both men were animated and angry. Loxley said today heated discussions are part of the job. As a head coach, I, I, I reserve the right to try to do whatever it takes, uh, you know, without crossing lines to ensure that uh, my coaches, my players, and everybody involved with the program uh, are, are meeting the standards that I set. Loxley is paid $750,000 a year. If worse came to worse and he was fired for cause, UNM would not have to pay him beyond the date of his termination. Dick, back to you. Okay, Alex. Now, as far as J.B. Gerald goes, he remains on paid administration.